Hi, I'm Elisabeth. I'm design lead of Lego Duplo and I'm super excited to introduce you today to the product and play experiences of our toys. Small kids grow so fast, so we design our toys with versatility of play, so the toy can actually grow with your child at every age and stage of their development. In the preschool age, there are three main play types that are really important for the child. So I would like to share a bit about them, so you can recognize them when your kid is playing. When you unbox the product, give your child the time to explore the bricks. In this way, they can train their cognitive skills and their motor skills. So, for example, finding bricks in the same color or similar shapes, what's up and down, is really helping them to train their cognitive skills and finding a window that opens and closes or a car that can drive by that is really training their motor skills in a really fun and playful way. Here's a little play tip to get started. Ask your child to find all the yellow bricks. With this selection of bricks, it's really easy for the kid to come to a fast uh, creation, which really builds their confidence and gives them a great start into the play. Kids are copying the real world. That's how they learn to understand and make sense of the world. So here are a few tips on how you can encourage role play with Duplo bricks. You can ask your kid to find their favorite brick. It might be a character or an animal. And the small items really inspire the child. For example, with the guitar, they might start to sing a song or with the little bat, they might play out an important moment of going to sleep. And little birthday cake might to start out a whole party of play for the small kid. As a parent, you can also point on the different objects, like on the sheep, for example, to encourage the communication skills. The child might first just make the sound, then name the animal, and later on it will start to tell a whole story around what is happening. Those small starts of play really help the kid to express itself and to communicate. So it's a really great start to play with the small kids. All the blue bricks click together. And that's where it all starts. You can ask your child to take bricks apart and try to put them together again. That will really help them to understand the clutch power. And ask your child to pick a big favorite brick they have. And encourage them to build them together. They will be so proud and really that will build their confidence as well. Small kids naturally build and they rebuild it again. And this is a great way to practice because by taking it apart and building it together, they're training their motor skills and their cognitive skills. This will enable them to come from a very small build up to a big build. Here's a building tip for you and your child. Build side by side, find similar bricks and then start to put them together. And you will see that naturally your child will copy you and make their own wonderful creation out of it. The magic of this toy is that the bricks can be built together in so many different ways. There's really no right or wrong in how to make your beautiful creation. And of course we give you building instruction and inspiration to start out the, the building and the play but at the same time you make it into your unique creation. Here's a simple principle to guide your child in the play. You can start always with a base, then build a structure, and at the end decorate. And that works with a car, but it works really with everything. A tree, a unicorn, or whatever you or your child comes up with. Free play is also a very fun way for your child to just engage and explore all the different ways to play. See what your child comes up with, how they build, how they play and what they explore 
to really um, just see the magic and the inspiration that comes out um, of the situation with your child. So I wish you a great time playing with the Duplo toys and watching your child learning in a playful way.